It seems gifts weren't the only thing exchanged over the holiday season. Flu germs spread all over the country with widespread flu activity right here in Kansas. KSNT News morning anchor Brittany Moore reports that doctors are scrambling to treat the high number of patients. 2018 is off to a pretty sick start. The CDC reports 46 states have widespread flu activity, including Kansas. It was over the weekend that we recognized that our volume was increasing. North of San Diego, ER doctors set up a special tent outside the hospital to handle a surge in flu patients. The last time they needed an extended treatment area was during the 2009 flu pandemic. I'm concerned um, that, uh, <laughs> that this one may hit us hard. So far, 41,000 cases nationwide this season. Our transport numbers have never been higher. The flu can be deadly, especially for those with underlying health conditions. Baby came in with some respiratory problems. Those patients truly need emergency care, but most people with the flu will recover without any complications. These patients could truly stay home and seek medical attention with their primary care physician instead of rushing to the emergency department. The flu vaccine is not as effective this year, but experts say some protection is better than none. Even if you get sick having had the vaccine, your illness tends to be milder, not quite as severe. The vaccine also lessens your chance of getting complications from the flu, like pneumonia. People with the flu describe it as feeling like they've been hit by a truck. Miserable body aches, fever, fatigue. Along with plenty of rest and fluids, your doctor's office can prescribe an antiviral to help you feel better, faster. Brittany Moore, KSNT News.